What is a CNC router and how does it work? A CNC router is a machine that automatically does everything humans do, but faster, more accurately, and without fatigue or rest. It can cut, drill, and engrave many different materials, wood, plastics, soft metals. However, the machine still needs a person to operate it. And in this video, we will explain how this process works and what you need to know and be able to do to make this magic machine do what you need it to do. Stages of work on a CNC router. The process begins with the creation of a 2D or 3D model of the product using specialized design software, CAD, computer-aided design. The next step is to convert the finished drawing into G-code, a set of commands understood by the machine tool's control system. The G-code tells the machine what spindle speed to use, at what speed, depth, and in what coordinates to move the cutting tool. These parameters depend on the material being machined, the cutting tool selected, and the machine parameters, such as spindle power. CAM, computer-aided manufacturing software, is used to specify all cutting settings and to convert a 2D or 3D model into G-code. Designers often use combined CAD-CAM software programs that have the functionality of both and allow both tasks to be performed in the same workspace. Before running the file on the machine, it can be run in test mode in the software to identify and correct any errors. The control program file must then be transferred to the milling machine. Before starting the machine, make sure it is ready. Check that the chiller is on and working, that you have secured the cutter well and that the material to be machined is securely clamped. It is much easier to clamp the material on milling machines with a vacuum table. Just press a button and the material is securely fixed. You should pay particular attention to the cutter. Use a cutting tool that is designed for the material you are working with. If you use the wrong cutter, you run the risk of breaking or blunting it quickly. Check that there are no foreign objects in the working area and that the cutter does not touch the securing clamps during operation. Set the machine to zero before starting. This can be done manually or automatically using a special tool sensor. Now you can start machining. The machine performs the specified operations by moving the cutting tool in three dimensions. During operation, the CNC router automatically adjusts the cutting speed and depth of cut to the preset parameters, resulting in high quality, repeatable parts. The DSP controller can be used to adjust settings on the fly. This controller is usually available as an optional accessory for the machine. If everything went smoothly, then the layout has been created correctly and all the settings are correct. Once the part has been produced, the quality of the product should be assessed and any necessary measurements taken to check that they are within the required dimensions. What knowledge is required to work? The skills required can be divided into those relating to the creation of the layout and those required directly in the milling process. To create a layout, as we have already seen, you need to be able to work with CAD CAM software. And this ability does not only mean mastering the software tools, but also the ability to read and create drawings. Milling requires a basic knowledge of materials technology, i.e. knowledge of the properties of a particular material in order to be able to select the tools and the correct settings according to the characteristics of the machine. It also requires familiarity with measuring instruments such as micrometers and calipers and, of course, to know and observe basic safety precautions. In addition, working on a CNC router requires skills in the maintenance and adjustment of the machine. CNC milling machine training is available at technical colleges or on vocational training courses. Watson has been manufacturing CNC milling machines since 2003, and we offer our customers not only lifelong information support, but also assistance with commissioning, maintenance, and of course, complete training on the CNC milling machine.